connected with uh, this is the main frame this is the spring lock for holding the tongue blade these are the springs which are which can hold the sutures and uh, help in retracting the uh, palatine flaps uh, this is the tongue blade this tongue blade has a notch inside to give space for the uh, tube to in, uh, endotracheal tube to uh, come out uh, partially and give a space and avoid any uh, pressure on the endotracheal tube uh, with lines, uh, and these are the cheek uh, retractors now we will assemble the uh, instrument this tongue blade will go inside uh, this lock and come out so this lock has a spring mechanism and auto locking uh, mechanism so while assembling we have to push it completely till the uh, this end of the frame then when we have to put inside the mouth these are the tooth uh, blades these tooth blades should fit in the first premolars depending on the size of the mouth uh, but these should fit in the teeth of the baby not on the uh, incisors on the premolars or the molars after bringing into the center they put the frame inside the mouth and gradually retract keeping the tongue in the center and the tube in the center gradually retract the blade so that we open the mouth so this much it should open depending on the mouth size so this will give a clear view of the palate till the oropharynx and then to retract the cheeks we insert the cheek blades to insert the cheek blades we have to pass this cheek blade in the notch and after keeping, keeping this notch inside tighten it lightly and we will retract the cheek this way to the maximum and then tighten it here so both sides cheek retractors will fit in like this so this should be the final assembly